Today's video comes from Seth Godin's blog. Here's the link to his post, and I also include the link in the description section of this video, too. His blog post is entitled, Sort by Price. Here is his blog post. Imagine a supermarket, or any store for that matter, where the items are arranged by price. At one end is the salt and the chewing gum, and at the other end are mops and steaks. We always think about the cost of an item before we buy it, but we don't buy it because of what it costs. If you find yourself acting like you sell a commodity, saying, this is category X and the price is Y, then you've ceased doing any sort of marketing. You're a commodity provider by choice, which is fine, as long as you're okay with competing in a race to the bottom. The alternative is to do the difficult and risky work of earning attention, earning a reputation, and mostly telling a story that takes your product or service out of the commodity category and into a space defined by connection, meaning, and possibility instead. Low price is the refuge for the marketer who doesn't have anything more meaningful to offer. Seth Godin is right. So now that you know what selling by the lowest price almost certainly means, using the same analysis, ask yourself, what does shopping by low price mean for the shopper?